Sir, what are the common reasons of Google Play console termination? Nice question. So in 2025, after AI has been launched, there are so many top reasons of getting termination of your GP console account. Let's deep dive into this. Let's come to the cabin. So in 2025, there are five common reasons of your Google Play Console account termination. The first reason which I found during my different consultation programs is so many GP Console owners rent their account to someone else and even they don't know who the person is going to use it. In Upwork and Freelancer, there are a lot of posts of project where people are asking for renting GP console accounts. And out of most of the posts, most of the clients are spammy or buggy applications or the applications which they are asking you to upload on your account is mostly violating the Google's policies. So in 2025, the number one reason which I found is renting out your own GP console account to someone else you don't even know. So never ever rent out your GP console account to somebody else. The second topmost reason which I found is don't following a proper Google Play console policies. Before uploading your application and industry of your application, you have to take care of few of the policy violations and policies of Google. If you are uploading a finance application, if you are uploading SMS application, if you are uploading dating applications or social media applications on your Google Play console, there are different policies available for different kind of applications. Make sure that you are not violating any of the Google policies in your console account. Third major reason of termination or removing GP console account in 2025 is not completing a proper verification processes. After October 23 and November 23, Google has provided a lot of time for an account which has been created before 23 or 22. They have provided so many emails, notifications, email alerts to the peoples to do a complete verification process. This verification process is nothing but just asking a simple few KYC kind of documents to all the users or owners of GP console which they have to provide. So if you have not completed this process, your account may get terminated or maybe removed. If your account is removed due to this verification process, then there is a very high chance you can create an another account you can upload the same application and your account will again never get terminated. So Google has provided this functionality or this facility for all the people who has not had a chance to complete the verification process. So number three, third reason in 2025 is not completing the verification process. Number four, biggest reason which I found is uploading an application having a policy violations. So if your application has Google AdSense, some other advertise modules, if your application is of dating industry, if your application is of SMS industry. So for this different industries, they have a complete different norms. For fin finance industry or fintech application, there is a different norm. You have to follow these things. So if you are uploading your app with a violation, there is a high chance your application get terminated in 2025. And the fifth and the biggest reason I have ever found during my consultation session is Google console owners are underestimating the Google's errors, Google's strikes, Google's suspensions or related to the any notification as a dangerous Google is notifying you. So if you get any strike from the Google about violating the policies, about rejecting your application, you have to be aware. You have to check this issue personally in detail that why your application got rejected. You have to resolve these issues as soon as possible. 
otherwise the chances of your termination of gp console accounts are very high stay tuned with me for more videos like this and feel free to reach out to us for any kind of consultation for google pay console thank you